comedian is somebody who took me under their wing when I first started out in comedy. He's pushing it together with Scotty, you guys. He's not an Elvis Presley impersonator, although I'm sure he can make way more money doing that if he tried. Give it up for the funny Scotty Chee. The very hilarious, the very great Scotty Chee. Give it up for Scotty. Well, hello guys, I am Scotty Chee. <laughs> Actually, we're going to be in the new uh, Star Wars movie. We're going to be the characters Storm and the Capital Troopers. <laughs> Just kidding, we're going to be Chewbacca's gay nephews. <laughs> C-U-N-T. C-word. I lost. And I got suspended. Because the judge was a c <laughs> You can go fuck yourself, Scott. No live, just recording. Oh, give you a hug. Oh. How come you don't stream anymore? I will. I don't feel like it. <laughs> it's, I don't feel it. It's such a bitch it is to stream, but also you gotta remember, last time we streamed, the chat was full of idiots. Yeah, they, they usually are. Bye, Miranda. Oh, you're leaving now? Oh, shit, get over here. Give me, come, come here and give me a hug and a kiss. Hey, Gordon, can you give me some water? No, bitch. <laughs> <laughs> All right, see, just, see you, baby. Make all the Pull it from the tab. Sounds good. Uh, one more, th one more thing. Can you check to see if the uh, microphone is recording on my on my computer? You'll see like blue bars going whoop and whoop whoop. It's kind of like a uh, like a heart monitor. You're our Jamie. Powerful. Jamie. Oh yeah, it's going. Good. I, see, um, I can see it on your. Um, Very good. Well, that's the microphone on, on the, um, the mixer. On the mix, oh yeah, the mixer, good. the mixer's on. I can see it bouncing. If, dude, if you think about it, it was like a year ago when you when you first came on podcast. I like, was yeah. just about to say yeah, it was like a year ago. The last time I was here was the first weekend that Gordon featured at Snappers. Oh, Your yeah. first feature. Oh, yeah. oh, are you sure about that? Cause yeah. I, no, I remember. I remember we did one, um, like in August or September of last year. When my when I dyed my hair Wait, really maybe, dark, no, because no, we it was you were featuring you did the no because we you no, did the um maybe you we because that was the time when we did the January sixth special, well, yeah we did a live stream on January sixth and just started oh, roasting people. everybody oh. on January sixth. But but cheers guys, dude. Cheers, cheers. I, I'm to, so, uh, so glad to we have finally you guys get on. to do this. Cheers. Yeah, yeah, finally. Yeah. So Eight it's years been a later, time coming. Eight, Eight years later, the best podcast ever. It is fucking lootly. It is. We Everybody? got uh, young, whatever the fuck is. My brother got me in for my for my birthday. I I walked in. I'm just like, what the fuck? And then his birthday was a week after mine, and I was like, oh man, what can I get my brother? So I was like, I gotta just get him something Hasbulla related too. So I decided to give him a Hasbulla tapestry, and it's huge. <laughs> and it's it's Hasbulla wearing like a chef's outfit, and um, now he's using it as my mom's. Um, tablecloth and my mom hates it i was gonna say is uh is tapestry is tapestry. that is that that's one <laughs> only something white Ta people ta buy. tapestry and it is pretty much just a blanket that's too short to be a blanket isn't that what a tapestry is i have no clue what a tapestry is i, th so I think I a, ta know. a tapestry is basically like a good decorating thing that white girls use like a, like a I'm dating a white skinny. girl. We don't have no tapestry in the house. I just want you to know that. <laughs> it's it's kind of like um like um a window curtain, but for no windows. So it's just there. It's just there. It, it, like it, sometimes it'll have like space. a peace sign. Sometimes it'll have Hezbollah wearing a fucking chef's outfit. Tapestry. You know, I just think it's a funny word. It, it is. is a funny word. Tapestry. It's, it's something that you could like would have appreciated in like eighteen in the eighteen yeah. hundreds because like you didn't yeah. have anything going on so like your grandma Just, probably yes. stitched that up like, that was like a version of art but now you have so many other I mean, fucking things that it's you like can, a castle I mean thing. Gordon's grandma probably in the eighteen hundreds because he's fucking what like fifty. Yeah. Fuck you, but yeah, I'm around there. Yeah, I'm, <laughs> no, I'm, I'm close fucking. to it. <laughs> I mean, I am. 39, baby. What's no, up? Hell fall, yeah, baby. Falling apart. Yeah. Yeah. Old, you know where I heard apart. tapestries? Indiana Jones. Yeah, we got the many tapestries. Last Crusade, yes, yeah. yes. And if you're a Scottish Lord. We are here Lord, for the tapestries. If you're a Scottish Lord, then, then I, I am, am Mickey, Mickey Mouse. <laughs> How, How dare, dare he? he? <laughs> that was Back's a great movie. Fucking... That was a great high five. Hell yeah, brother. I love Indiana Jones. Did you see the new one yet? 
No, no, I don't want to see it. He's it was, 700 years old. I'm good. I'm good. I got this fucking guy 90 years old. Still, yeah. He's still doing stuff. Whooping ass, Dude, too. the best part of the movie was the beginning. If you don't mind spoilers, I mean, you're not going to watch No, it. So, I don't give a shit. So the opening yeah. of the film is uh, literally Harrison Ford sleeping with his shirt off in underwear, and there's these kids partying in his apartment because he's uh, he, he lives like in a like in a college town in New York, and they're all just fucking jamming out to like Led Zeppelin. He wakes up with like a fucking like a broom. He's like, hey, shut that guy damn music off and i'm like why do they have to make indiana jones old now because like, he is old i know but he could still be cool <laughs> i mean i mean like come on like I don't know, when you've traveled <laughs> the world and stolen hearts from people and you know fuck you saw the ark of the covenant you i mean you fucking you drank the blood of christ i mean you're Come on, I feel like you want to sleep a poorly. little early. <laughs> <laughs> After you've done all that, you want to fucking sleep and not hear some bitch ass kids. Now I would let yeah, them party. At that age, yeah, you want to sleep. When you're older, you need sleep. I need sleep. I need sleep now, and I'm 30. Well, I'm saying the older you get, the more you need it because you don't sleep. You're looking forward to eternal sleep. Yeah. When you're that old. Eternal yeah, I can't wait to sleep <laughs> more than four hours. Like, so you mean that? Does that mean you're just excited to die? Yes. Yeah. Yeah. You're just fucking. You've done it, especially in Indiana Jones's position. Like you've done so you've much. Done, he's done everything. He saved Asian everyone. He, he did multiple shoot. times. He did save it. He saved a bunch of kids. Yeah. He saved. So many chicks that he ended up... His dad is Sean Connery. I would never want to live anymore. He's dead. I suddenly remembered my Chalamet. Sean Connery. Let the rocks and the trees and the birds in the sky be my arms. (laughs) Sean Connery. Did you see the SNL skit where they did... uh, He was on Jeopardy? No. Sean Connery? No. And the the, the question was was S-words. He was, I'll take swords for... (laughs) For three hundred Alex. Was it Sean Connery or was it no, someone playing Sean Connery? I don't know who it was, playing. whoever was playing him, but he was fucking hilarious. Have he you, did it perfect. Have you have you seen the video of Sean Connery talking about why, why is it, yeah, it's why it's good to beat women? <laughs> if they're not listening to you, you gotta give them the back. You gotta give them a backhand. Backhand. <laughs> <laughs> you gotta give them the back of the hand. You gotta they give got, them backhand. They got to pay attention there. <laughs> when somebody's that old, are they even like are they even cancelable No, no, he's no. he's he's binging, he's done everything. He's, he's, done just, everything, like, he's just like he's just like he's just like Indiana Jones. He's done everything. What does it matter? Right? Like let him beat somebody. I mean okay. it's kind of, I mean it's kinda of like you now people are trying to cancel John Wayne for like now? saying stuff about Chinese people. Yeah. Jeez, like, 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 they'll go, like, go, they'll get an interview of him, like, playing. He played Genghis Khan. Yeah, like, oh, yeah, I've seen, seen that on yeah, uh, Joe Rogan. It was, it was awful. Yeah. It's yeah. literally a guy going, Hey, hey damn, pilgrims. He's so white. <laughs> Happy. He's <all> white. We'll get- <laughs> <laughs> I'm ready to take over China, pilgrims. You, like, aren't you Mongolian? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> you gotta have Mongolian action. <laughs> sounds like a country Mongolian. Dude, like at that point, I mean, white people rule. We're ruling everything. So, I mean, you can't. What are you gonna? We're just all gonna go back and be mad at racism. You can't go again. back and no, the, you, the person's already dead. You know what I mean? Exactly. Like, yeah. I mean, like, do I agree with with John Wayne's like beliefs? I'm just kidding. No, I don't believe him. So yeah, just but that was what? Back in the 20s and 30s? 20s and 30s. Yeah. See, like, he fucking was born, like, what, 18 something? Listen, my family owned my family, okay? I'm I'm fine with it. <laughs> Whatever. Well, it's, dude, it's like it's like having the the argument and conversation about blackface. Like, yeah. why are we still having that? We know that shit, that shit is fucked up, yeah. and that's why yeah. we don't do it anymore. Yeah. Unless you're Robert Downey Jr. <laughs> but, yeah. Well, yeah, he, I don't think he's going to do it now, but. Tropical Thunder was the only way you can get have, have That you, was a great. That movie was awesome, though. Have you heard of the drug called melatonin? No, no, yeah. I'm not melatonin. Me, mel, 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 melanotan. I'm melanotan. 40, yes. I take melatonin <laughs> no, to go not, to sleep. Not, not melatonin? melatonin? No, melanotan. Melanin is my skin Melanotan. <laughs> melanotan. <laughs> melanotan. <laughs> it's, called, it's like a drug that people take to, like, to like darken their pigment. Oh, it's kind of the it's opposite like of what Sammy Sosa of, it's, took. It's like rever- yeah, and Michael Jackson. Yeah. yeah, yeah, it's like reverse vitiligo Let's where go, you get. Dirt. I, I want to take that because I want to actually have people think I'm black. I so. just want a scholarship. <laughs> <laughs> but you have to be athletic too. <laughs> I, I hate to say this. You don't look athletic, bro. I'm just letting you know. I used to be pretty. Even probably. Big black dudes can run fast. Fuck dude. yeah, they can run fast. I used to see some big black dudes in my high school. Fucking just the way bl- you said big black court. dudes just hurt my heart, man. I've watched they, a used lot to, of they used to call me. They, when, I was in, when I was in high school, they used to call me the refrigerator because I was the like one of the biggest white kids that could run fast. 
And they're like, oh, yeah, you see, he runs fast like a refrigerator. I'm like, I, I like that, I guess. I've never seen a refrigerator run, but, yeah, okay. <laughs> I think there was, there was an old football player named, they refrigerator? called refrigerator. Yeah. I, 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 I think so. Yeah, I don't I think remember so. what team he played Is it Mike for. Ditka or something? Or, like, That's the somebody, coach of the just Bears. somebody old, maybe. He, he yeah. played football. <laughs> That's the coach of the Bears. Mike Ditka. Know. What a, Dicka. what a Dicka. name. What a you name. remember the, 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 the SNL, SNL game? game? Gordon Ditka. Yeah. With Mike Ditka. Who would win? In a fight, Mike Ditka or a hurricane? <laughs> but the hurricane's name is Ditka. <laughs> what? Yeah, hurricane so Ditka. good. So what, what are we doing here? I don't, I, I, don't, I don't know. I just I just said, hey, you guys want to come over and do a podcast? What are we talking about? No, because no, because Gordon's gonna because Gordon yesterday at Snappers was like, is this gonna be like an interview? I'm like, no, oh, it's not gonna be in the fucking interview. Because everybody's different. I don't out. know what people do. I just I want to interview you. Damn it! Oh, There's you know what? I do have a couple questions. Know. Let's do this. Jehovah's Witnesses. Uh oh, here we go. How was that? <laughs> oh God! It was the worst time of my life. That's why I'm doing comedy. What do you mean? How was it? How would you feel if you had to wake up every Saturday morning and go preaching in, in Florida heat in a suit? You would be miserable too. I don't care how much Holy Spirit we had. I didn't. I didn't. I never felt that spirit in a suit. In, well, not in a suit, I mean, but you're in a shirt and tie. Yeah, they make you dress up. They they sneak into my apartment complex all the time. Literally, wait for the gate no to be open. <laughs> Here's what we say: We're not soliciting because they're not selling anything. But they ask for donations if you want to leave a donation. So technically, they're not soliciting. So but wait, they basically wait, wait. So do you get paid to like go and? and oh, preach? you got to do this for the kindness of your heart. Jesus never got paid. So why would we? I don't know. I mean, <laughs> Jesus. I'm not a Jehovah's Witness anymore. Jesus was so Jewish. Know. He liked money. I mean, like, I, did he though? Yeah, yeah. He didn't he, have money. That I don't know. He didn't. Broke, he didn't dude. have no money. He, he was, he was a car. He, the desert. He was a carpenter. He fucking he he hustled. He if hustled you if you think Jesus liked money, he would have turned that fish into money. <laughs> yeah, he would. <laughs> he just would have been like, "Well, we got fish in the loaf. Give me that shit. I want money. <laughs> I'm gonna turn it into coins." That's not one story of Jesus. Turning something from wood and selling it, is there? No. Nope. They just say he was a carpenter. I mean, can you imagine? That's all they say. They never say what he did. Like a table that Jesus built. Like you like you put like fucking bread on it and it turns into money or something. But was he really a carpenter though? Because I feel like there would be things that he made. He built his own cross. What if (laughs) (laughs) No, he died on a stake. It's not a cross. It's a stake. That's what we said. It was a stake. Yeah, I I heard multiple stories. I heard there's another one where he actually was crucified on a tree when they just pulled like a big uh, slab, turned into a cross on a tree in the middle of a town. We'll never know. I mean, if you think about it, in Roman times, I, I hate to get all nerdy on you guys. Let's with, do with it. History. You're white. Um, yeah. <laughs> it's in you. Really? Huh? It's just in you. Just let it go. <laughs> let it go. I hate to get let all knowledgeable go. on you guys, but. <laughs> just listen, okay? I know everything. Uh, <laughs> Sounds about right. <laughs> so, so in Roman era times, you remember that? Uh, Roman Empire? Yes, I do. Yeah, I and, that, yeah. Uh, it was yesterday. Star Wars? Star Wars. I was a gladiator. Yes. The, uh, that's, the Roman Empire? Uh, that right. is... Uh, never mind. Uh, I was going to... <laughs> gladiator. Like, gladiator. Um, technically, yes. But anyway, in the Roman era, or Roman Empire times, they would crucify people in the middle of the towns because it's embarrassing to get crucified, so that's how they did it. And they supposedly thought Jesus might have been crucified on the side of a road. Damn, they couldn't even put him in a town, in the middle of the town? No. I mean, they're, the they're, Jesus? They're like, hey, look at this guy. He's getting his ass whipped. He's like, stop it. Damn. Sorry, I'm so sorry. Damn. Wait, I didn't realize Jesus sounded like Gilbert you know Gottfried either. Thinking, thinking back to those times, how crazy it is to be well known in those times without any internet. No you're internet. Literally just walking people, everywhere. And people are like, that's Jesus. How the freak did they know that? There's no uh, pictures word, of him back of, then. Word of mouth. You know, basically, what? if you do, if you do fucking... Uh, his um, ministries, people were like, hey, did you hear that fucking weird Jewish guy over there d- talking about why we should Yeah, but, but they knew who he was right away. It wasn't like yeah. they seen pictures of him or anything. It was no. just like, hey, that's Jesus. Like, if no one knows Devin, if well, Devin well, walks to the mall, no one's going to be like, hey, there's Devin. Well, oh? well first of all, they do. One, <laughs> who? One day. One day, day yeah, but not now. Well, first of all, the he, his, his name wasn't the. Jesus. It was Yeshua. That's how they pronounced it. His name was that. Jesus. Was he was Puerto Rican. He was Puerto Rican. Puerto Rican. Yahweh is God, Jehovah. Whatever, dude. I don't I'm just letting y'all know, I, man. Dude, I didn't study. Hey, me and Jesus got something in common, okay? What, He's what, what you got? died at 33, and I stopped being a Jehovah's Witness at 33. Hey. I'm trying to work on a joke ball about that, but I can't. I'm, I'm trying to figure out well, how to do subjects it. Subjects are very hard. Yeah. To be yeah. like, to like, uh, like, 
It's something there, though. The joke is yeah, it's that, there. The something joke there. Is that there. Your, religion, your religion died the same time, at yeah. the same age as uh, yeah. Jesus. And people don't want to hear that. Nobody wants that, yeah. <laughs> they want you to say, you still love Jesus at 39. Yeah, they, you know. I, I like know. Jesus. I, I, drink, think he's, uh, I think he's cool. I mean, I'm not, I wouldn't call myself like a, you know. I love him. He turned religious. water into wine. That's the coolest guy thing cool I've ever heard. Fuck. If he really uh, did it, who knows? What do, you, do you like Jesus? I remember, like Jesus? I will tell you a story. Um, <laughs> speaking of Jesus. Do uh, you like Jesus? <laughs> what? <laughs> this is this is a, a far right Christian podcast. I will tell you. We got you. Uh, what about you? Uh, you like Jesus? <laughs> I, yeah, I heard it's cool. I will tell you that I grew up in a very. My parents are not religious, but my, both of my gr- grandparents were pastors. Oh, for, no shit. Uh, yeah, so. Um, my grandfather was a pastor. My my grandmother was a pastor. So, like, I grew up, Jeez. whenever I got kicked out of my parents' house as a kid, I would stay with them, and I would have to go to church on Sunday super early, see all of the services, like, one, two. It's like being a host because you have to stay for all five shows. Yeah, um, all terrible five shows. I would fall asleep every single service and then there was this one time where i went to this tongue speaking church oh no and, like uh, that is satan oh, dude, speaking in tongues crazy yeah. i don't remember i don't remember much about it i was like i probably had to been like seven or eight and this lady that taught at the preschool that i went to which was a christian preschool um invited us all to come to her church afterwards and this one preschool i don't know why like eight kids went with this random preschool teacher like our parents were just like yeah you can go with a 21 year old teacher and she played eminem's marshall mathers lp on the way to church that song kim where he's like cool as fucking he's talking about putting his like wife in the trunk and yeah shit. yeah Going to church, listening to that, and then we get there, and... That got you hyped for Jesus. Dude. <laughs> that got you hyped. We were ready to murder and yeah. repent. I'm going to kill for God. <laughs> Jesus from Flint, baby. So <laughs> so we do the service, and at, at some point in the tongue speaking, they invite everyone to come up to like the, the uh, pew or whatever to like kneel and pray and stuff. And me and my buddy go up there. We kneel, we, we, kneel, we pray, fall asleep. <laughs> Fall asleep. Been, been there, done that. Dude. And my buddy wakes up in time to like go, oh shit, gotta go back to my seat. He didn't wake me up. The tongue speaking preacher had to wake me up and then held me by the wrist. <laughs> held me by the wrist through the rest of the service, speaking in tongues. What a fucking G. So me and Jesus. Did he move your hand closer to the, you know? Yeah. <laughs> it was a. Uh, held you by the wrist, huh? He's like, <laughs> So me and Jesus, we have a we <laughs> so have a Jesus. we have a rough patch, but we're cool. But Jesus is cool, man. Uh, but it's funny because you mentioned the like like the hosting in five shows. I, I I'm working on a bit right now where I'm talking about how priests were the original podcast hosts. They think about it, like well, like one show a week, uh, extra shows is like a funeral or a wedding or a baptism. I'm trying to work on something right there. The original it's, podcasters without podcasting. Yeah, if you think about it, I mean like I, I mean they had, they had a huge following. The people that are like, oh, and then they, they crack in stupid jokes in the middle of their fucking sermons. I don't know. I don't know any priests. So I, 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 yeah, I, I, grew up, I grew up Catholic, so yeah, yeah. I, I know. Yeah, my mother was Catholic. I've met before. a couple. I, I, uh, when I was living in New York, there there was a cathedral right across the street from mm-hmm. the apartment. Cathedral. That Kate, cathedral. Caitlin cathedral. It's another funny in. word. And um, my grandmother was friends with the guy <laughs> that like was a, was a priest there, so... She told him that I was there and I was a comedian and he wanted to meet me and I stupidly invited him and all of his friends to come to a show because, you know, five Oh, five and that's when you were on you were on the five shit then too, bringer, right? Dude, I, they were, oh, I was doing bringer yeah. shows in New York. I was yeah. desperate. Hell so yeah. I told the priest and all of their people to come and he came to a show and uh, and then afterwards, bless you, boy. He left without saying anything. But I got a, a, a call from him, and I didn't answer because I didn't know the number. But I, I was it like a, a was like a line to an exorcism or something. It was like a nine one two number or something. I he forgot. was speaking in tongues on the message. No, <laughs> you gotta have back to draw. You gotta go into hell, that boy. <laughs> He invited me to see dinner. So you could. <laughs> he invited you to dinner. He invited me to dinner. <laughs> he was trying to fuck, bro. That man was trying to fuck, bro. He was trying to get you lit. I got him excited because hey, he told me. Oh, hey, you got him excited. His, hey. his review of my set was I've never heard so many fucks. <laughs> that was the old Devin, too, right? It was. Yeah, I was that's very, funny. I was very high. That's funny. Time. 
That's funny, bro. <laughs> the old Devin. Yeah, I used to. I didn't I, know I, what I, I was I, doing. Yeah, you, <laughs> yeah, you told me. You told me about the old Devin. You know. The old Devin. I Hold on, let me. I gotta cross my legs, like y'all. I used to get down. I like. I felt left out because you guys were crossing legs. I was like, let me let me join. Crossing the left leg. Let me join. This is this is this is how a straight men cross it. I I can't stand when I see dudes like Dude, this. Dude, how how do you do? This hurts my ball instantly. Yeah. I'm not my, even ball squished. My nuts are like fucking. It looks like I don't know what they look like right now, but ow, they hurt. It it looks like you ever you know put bologna in a sandwich. Yeah, that's what it looks like. It's just smashed yeah. in between two or, thighs. Or when you wear like really tight pants, but the and meat's and hanging and out the side of it. Right, yeah. that's what. Or, bologna roll up. Or when you bro. wear like really tight pants, and your yeah, and your hurt. dick and balls look like at the vision sign. Yeah, like, like a camel tail, M- mammal tail. Yeah. C- camel yeah. Tail? To- what do they call it? A hoof? Call a man camel camel tail uh, a hoof, the, uh, hoof or something? Chubby girls, um, cam- camel chubby tails girls. are called uh, camel toes are called moose knuckles. Moose knuckles. Ch- yeah. Ooh, yeah. yeah. Is yeah. It, it's just big girls. Big girls. Yeah, big girls. I just thought if it was a big. Fat vagina, moose knuckle. Well, fat well, skinny girls don't have fat vaginas. I don't yeah, think. You'd be surprised, dude. Sometimes I mean, I've seen a lot. I don't think they're that. Um, I've seen a lot of vaginas. Skinny girl with a fat vagina. That would look weird. No, nah, it would look like she's a dude, yeah, right? It would look. It would look like Kegels, the fucking. It would, the walls it would look like my like my the like, inside. It would look like my double chin. The outside, a bit, kind of. If I had, if I got rid of this, if yeah. you shave, yeah, it looked like my double chin. All right, we'll be right back <laughs> with a word from our sponsor, <laughs> Double Chin. <laughs> Double Chin. <laughs> Here's Blue Chew, everybody. No, I, I am not getting rid of You got a problem with your dick. Does it got to get hard on every... I don't know. That was just a commercial. <laughs> you got erectile dysfunction, but you're afraid to go to the doctor to get some Viagra? I want to no do commercials. No problem. You can go to Blue Chew, motherfucker. Blue Chews. I want to do commercials, I but have, like a, fucked you'd, up you'd versions. Be, you'd be a great... That fucking, would be hilarious. You'd be a great pitchman. I would sure. want. I want to pitch commercials. Just anything, any commercial, whatever it is. Tampons. <laughs> just let me do it. Uh, I want you. To is your pitch. pussy bleeding? Are you hurting inside? <laughs> <laughs> well, uh, get triple max. I uh, want you to pitch. <laughs> All right, I here we go. All right, let's pitch some. Give me some wine. You want me to do white wine? No, I love white no, wine. No, 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 no. I want you to put a pitch. All day access passes to Bush Gardens. All day access passes to Bush Gardens. Okay, here, here, here's the scenario. All right, there's a family. And they want to go to Bush Gardens for the weekend. Yeah. But they don't want to just wait in line, right? They want to go all day access to Bush Gardens. So what you do is you call 1-800 all day access, right? I pick up the phone. Hello. <laughs> yeah, so uh, it's my daughter's birthday, right? And um, we're trying to do something at Bush Gardens. Said, Have you heard of our new package called the all day access package? Not only can you go to Bush Gardens all day. But you could get all the access. I don't know. That was terrible. No, I, I was. Uh, <laughs> I got one. I, I kind of want to go. Are you tired of your kids running around like crackheads, running wild? Well, take well, your ass down to Bush Gardens where they can run with the cheetahs all fucking day. All day access. That's what we need. Commercials with curse words in it. We do. That's what will make it's, the it's commercial on, better. It's honest, and it's definitely yeah. I mean, it's more. Re- I mean, who? Everyone curses. Erectile dysfunction. Does your fucking dick not work? <laughs> Are you tired of your flaccid ass dick? That would be the greatest commercial ever. I would be like, I, yeah, I'm tired of it. Let Dude, me. <laughs> I sell catheters, so I mean, like, yeah. If, if it says if you if your dick's uncontrollably wait, 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 leaking, wait, 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 wait. he sells catheters. You sell catheters, like outside of. Oh no no no! In reality, o- o- over the phone. Over yeah, the phone. You sell. You really do sell catheters. Yeah. How much? <laughs> He's gonna buy. Would you buy one? <laughs> you got Medicare. He's trying to, you know. <laughs> you gotta have Medicare try, try to get his catheters, though. Yeah. He's trying to try something new. Try something new. Uh oh. I, I think I have a sample somewhere in my uh, my bag. They give you a, a, a free trial. <laughs> uh, a free week supply on top of your first order of Medicare. Oh, that's gotta hurt. Ah. Actually, no. It doesn't go inside your penis. It's on the outside. It's uh, it's on the tip of it. Oh, okay. That's it's not, not, bad. not like a condom either. I've worn it actually when, when I first started the job. I uh, literally I put it on right after right after work, and I drove drove to Ocala to go see family for Christmas. I'm sitting in the car. I'm peeing right in my pants, right into, right into the. Pouch. You got to know the product. Yeah, you, you know what? That's not a bad idea no. for like truck and, drivers. Like I drive a garbage truck. That dude, would be great. I wouldn't oh, have yeah. to stop, go to a gas station, 
you know, gas stations got the worst damn bathrooms Fuck in the world. Yeah, they're yeah, disgusting. Yeah. yeah. No, and um, I'm and then I go to the bar to meet up with my with my siblings and my cousins and stuff and some friends, and I'm literally talking to people I went I went to high school with, peeing my pants right in front of them. They don't even. Oh, know you it. just left it on when I you got there. Left it on. He still got it on right I now, and never and never <laughs> dumped the pee out. Never dumped the pee out. I, I was eight running. months of pee in there. I, <laughs> <laughs> What's the smell like urine here? It's just mm-hmm. catheter. I gotta change it eventually. <laughs> <laughs> it's it's uh oh, what what do they call it? Uh when when you fucking uh, make like um like like uh tea where you like you it's fermenting. Cleans. I'm fermenting oh, my piss yeah. and it's turning yeah. into fucking like vodka. Yeah, that shit was vodka because you were drinking too, so I yeah, that's all the leftovers. Yeah. I remember when I was in the seventh grade, <laughs> uh, we did uh our science class, we had like a science fair project, like you know when you're in science class class you get a project you got to do it. my buddy did a, a project his project was um one plant given all water and then the other plant pissed he peed on it and the plant that got peed on died obviously and he did a full science well, project yeah. about it. was got he white F. he was white <laughs> she, yeah. yeah well he's like puerto rican and white oh. but uh oh, okay. the fucking teacher white gave him an f and it was like a solid project like you wanted to know. Yeah, which you know, which one would work? And you know why plants die when you pee on them too much? Because your That's pee is acid. high in nitrogen. Yeah, it's high in nitrogen. Yeah, well, yeah because it's the waste of your the shit yeah. you drink. Yeah, so it definitely wouldn't help anything grow. It was a great science project. This, dude. Is, this, is, like, this is a good one. What's going on right here? Uh, this this wasn't me. This was my brother actually, and he's got a. He's probably not gonna like that I'm saying it, but I'm not gonna say his name. Uh, when you, when we know it's your brother though. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> I'm not gonna say his name. You only got one brother, bro. Well, come on. You know, never know that <laughs> <laughs> still not gonna say his name though anyway he uh when he was in high school he told me um uh he had to do like a project where he had to go swab like shit uh from like, a, like onto like a petri dish to see how much like bacteria grows on the petri dish so his teacher said go do the bathroom and go do like the water fountain and then go do like the vending machines so he did the vending machine and the water fountain and then when we got to, when we got to the bathroom he decided to put his nuts on the petri dish idiot so then he told he told a bunch of his friends that he's like, I put my balls in the Petri dish. And then literally, like, two weeks later, the Petri dish that he had put his nuts on was all fucking full of fungus. And stuff. Oh, he's got nasty he, nuts. I'm like, you got nasty nuts, dude. Is he not That's shower? Fucking... Is your brother not shower? Of course he showers. Hey, bro, you need to fucking he, shower. I don't even know that camera sees you, me. But... You need to shower my level. <laughs> was it high school? <laughs> it was high school. That's like peak shower time, too, because you yeah. want to get laid. Yeah, true. Like yeah. Now, I'm but you're going through puberty, showers. so you smell you a puberty, lot too. Yeah, you're oily. I mean, he probably, I don't know. He probably had gym class before that. I forgot the shower. In gym I class. shower all the. I'm about to go take a shower right now, just because. That's yeah, all I, I do. I need to take more showers. I was a stinky kid growing. Up. I never wanted to shower. We're, we're, all, we're all three going to take a shower now. I feel like I'm autistic. I'm down. I don't like being wet. Just get gay. Really? Like, I don't like being wet. You don't want to be. You don't, you don't like, like being you don't wet. Like going yeah, like, to the beach or swimming or anything. Yeah, like I. Well, I hate the beach because you know sharks. All the coral. Coral does so good. Don't like the good, you know. Fuck coral. I thought, man, you're I'm white. I thought kidding. you wanted I, coral. I've never seen you at the beach though either. I've never. I dude, the last time I went, <laughs> I went to the beach because that's where my honeymoon was. Yeah. Like yeah, I was gonna say you were just there. I didn't want to. I mean, you smoking a cigar. I didn't want to, but yeah, you wanted to be there. I saw you smoking cigars. I maybe had a couple cigars. I mean, I'm getting they, a beach house when I get famous. Hell yeah. That's the goal. I better be there. Yeah, everybody gonna be there Probably if I know you. Take huh? out that damn beach house. I'm gonna imagine. I'm gonna Wait, have where's a beach, the beach house? Fucking gonna, beach house. Where's, where's the beach house gonna be at? Somewhere around here. Clearwater, Clearwater right same thing. Whatever. I'm not going you far, want to bro. Hogan to yell the n-word at him. I do. I tell him all the time. <laughs> so I, I yell at him. What's up, my nigga? And he's just like, I don't know this guy. Wait, you yell at Hulk Hogan? I've seen him. I don't yell at him, but every time I do see him, I'm like, brother. Hey, brother. He's He'll like, wave. He just waves. He's <laughs> always in his garage working he looks out. He's good for his fucking age. He's huge. He's still huge. He's huge. Theo Vaughn's podcast. Did he freaking huge, man? He's Hell cool yeah. though. He gave me one Christmas time. I finally saw him. He gave me a hundred bucks. Just gave me no yeah, shit. Gave me That's bucks. There you go. H- have you, dude? Have you invited him to like come out to like a no? Show I don't. Or I'm. Something? I'm. Would, I wasn't doing comedy when I saw him. Oh, this was like so right when I started with Clearwater. Oh god. Um, yeah. But if I ever do see him, I want to go to his fucking um, his restaurant, his Hogan Hangout. I know, like Mondays that they, they do karaoke they, they and shit. The karaoke, yeah, yeah like Cosway? Mondays. Oh, okay. it's on uh, or, Mandalay. Is that like where the beach is? Yeah, right. It's right on Clearwater Beach. Yeah. yeah. Hmm. Another person who I would love to like sit down and talk with and eventually golf, John Daly. I don't even. know Everybody who that says is. he's cool as fuck. Oh he's yeah, a golf, he, golfer. Yeah, he lives in Clearwater actually. I always see clips of him. He's he's, he's pretty funny. Oh, he's hilarious. I don't even know who that is. Who's that? He's Who is a it? golfer, bro. Come on, man. He's yeah, a, I thought you were white. 
Doesn't mean I golf, dude. You are dressed like the I'm. I hate everyone. White guy, right now. <laughs> you should like, know John Daly. No. With, with, the, with the Crocs. Hey, dude. He's got right. camouflage Crocs. Are you hating on my crocodilians? <laughs> he's got this. Yeah. He's got. Is that a Stone Cold hat? Yeah. Yes. All right. I'm gonna. I'm not gonna talk Wait, to you about really that. Wearing a Stone Cold yeah, lost dude. It? I love that hat. Yeah. It's Wait, a Stone Cold. I, it's a shrimp. It's a so this rapper that I listen to his brand is called Steak and Shrimp. But oh. one of his mixtapes he did uh, he was called Texas Rattlesnake. Uh-huh. So he used like the the logo and shit, which is probably like copyright, but whatever, you know. I had a friend of mine who was on uh, Stone Cold Steve Austin's show. Uh, Stone Cold was it stopped, was it called Stone Cold's like Stone Cold something. It was when he interviews people, right? Yeah, it's they do. It's like toughest challenge or badass challenge. Or something oh, like that. I, I know you're talking about. Okay. Yeah, she because she 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 tried to get into professional wrestling. Funny enough, and um, then she was on a show and I think got like fucking dead last. Yeah, she, she got her, she got her ass kicked by, still by, by credit, some dude. other chick. It's still, still you still on his no, show? No, it's cool as fuck. Yeah, still on the show. Dylan Dylan Walker did a did, bear yeah. something. Whatever I, oh yeah, bear's I doing. did see that. Yeah, he yeah. was on that. It was pretty cool. That's hilarious. Yeah, I want to do something. I applied for a couple of like game shows, but nice. nothing, yeah, I'm but. sick of you know when I do big shows using the Hallmark credit because nobody gives a shit about. <laughs> Wait, you've done Hallmark shows? I've done a Hallmark movie. <laughs> Yeah, I did. I did. Oh, I just uh, recently did a little movie thing. Like I it's called Running called. from Air, but it's a yeah. black, like black comedy. I guess it oh, is. Really? I don't know. Well, like, I don't. Well, like, it's a, not, like a, was it like, Zobo? Wait, what do you mean black comedy? No, you mean afraid. like a dark humor comedy or like no, black, it was a black, black black like, comedy? Like yeah, like a oh, okay, like a like a Negro comedy, like a, like a <laughs> Wayne's Brothers movie or something. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, but like extra low budget, like <laughs> low, uh, but like we were using oh. like uh, Kodak, uh, Zo- Kodak, Kodak, Kodak cameras. Oh, once you got a. You, know, you take a you picture, gotta, you gotta wind it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that was once. Bro, yeah, no yeah, flash. You, yeah, you use Motorola phones. <laughs> it's gonna be one of those you just flip yeah, through. I, um, tell me about the Hallmark movie. That's hilarious. I, I, uh, I like, forgot what, what it was. What was it about? Like, a, like a guy who breaks up with his wife and then gets back with her at the end of Christmas time. Uh, My mom is a probably huge fan of you, by the way. My mom loves Hallmark movies. Fuck, what was, what was it, it was about, about all access past the Bush Gardens. That's what it was about. Yeah. <laughs> um, I forgot what it was called, but yeah, uh, like the scene I was in, it was like this up upstairs like bar. Did you have your mustache? No, I shaved it. Why'd you for shave it? it? For was, it? Yeah, I was. Won't even it look for like it. you. We don't even know it's you. Yeah, dude, that I sucks. got like a, I got like a fade, like nice haircut, slicked hair back. I was wearing like a button-up jeans. You know, ah, jeans. it's yeah. bullshit. I think you should have had the mustache. I was it. wearing like button-up jeans. You got real country. <laughs> <laughs> wearing a button-up jean You know what I'm talking about? Button down <laughs> jeans. Got, he wore jeans, jean shirt, jean jacket. I was all jeaned out. I got yeah. denim everywhere. Denim fucking boots. Denim underwear. <laughs> That's denim a, under- <laughs> dude, that must hurt so bad. Denim socks. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, Foot is just raw. Under, <laughs> denim underwear. Denim underwear. He's sweating. It's twenty degrees out. <laughs> oh my god, dude! I'm like sweating, just thinking of that already. Having That's denim all underwear. Denim imagine, underwear. Imagine having like a zipper where your underwear is, and you just zip up your fucking bush. Are I you a that. denim man? I want. Are that. you a Democrat? <laughs> Democrat. I, I will sell denim underwear after my set. You should. You should. I got a joke about uh, knee braces. I'm gonna try to come up. I'm trying to come up with a uh, some merch for it. I'm talking about though, making man. knee braces sexy, like lingerie knee braces. I have one idea for uh, for, for might a merch be. line. I might do it though. That's I might do it. If I get man. some money one day. Yeah. yeah. When I what, like eventually, I do have a shirt idea. I was thinking, I was thinking about doing my uh, one of my uh, bits where I say "Made in God's image" and just have my face on it, where I just look hideous and stuff. It's all about getting. Yeah. If the we're made in God's transfer. image and you're ugly as shit, is God ugly? Made in God's image. Yeah. Yeah. So therefore, God could be. That's the why most beautiful. you shouldn't tell anyone they're ugly, Gordon. I tell them all the time. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Scotty, <laughs> I'm smoking with you. Ah. Oh, I did bring you guys some uh, G grind braces. I don't know. I don't know if you have one, right? Wow, dude, it's taking this long. I, I don't even. Have, it's well, this you long. got one now. I don't want it. Come on, bro. <laughs> wow, this is perfect to fit around my cock. What? It's you got good. a big one there, huh? Yeah, that, dude, that's like a fucking like soda can right there. That's what I'm talking about. How much did it cost to make these? Like one dollar. Yeah, uh, I mean, I got 150 made, and it cost me G grind everybody at the Gordon the Dixon. Gordon Dixon baby it's hashtag G grind. You know where G grind the, came from? Uh, it came from Gordon grinding grind. on guy, gr- grinding on guys. Exactly. Gordon. I came. used to be a stripper, and the name of the show was called G grind. And I come out <laughs> in a denim thong. It's, it wasn't. It wasn't mad. <laughs> in a denim thong. <laughs> a denim G string. Yeah. <laughs> and, and steel toe stiletto boots. <laughs> Instead of Magic Mike, it's Sorcerer yep. Gordon. I had the I had the elephant trunk uh, underwear on. 
in denim. Yeah, my my right trunk there, was the elephant like, trunk. G grind. My dick. I've yeah. seen that underwear. Not yeah. on not on the you. Denim like, I just. I've seen I want to get some and just um tease Bettina one night and be like, hey babe, I'm gonna put some. I'm gonna slip into something comfortable and come out the room with like a bow tie and the elephant trunk on. It won't be an elephant trunk. Denim It'll just be a baby. Denim. I can, if I can get a denim one, that'd be fucking awesome. <laughs> we're, gonna, we're gonna come up. We're gonna denim make, underwear. Yeah, let's let's get make a, denim just, underwear. Just get a tra- Duluth Trading Company just, has just, denim underwear. They'll make you some denim underwear. Damn. Whoa. Damn, Why that was racist. Yeah, well, <laughs> well <laughs> so sorry. This has been canceled hour. <laughs> <laughs> what time? Thanks are for we having at? us over here. I'm the one drinking. 31 minutes. I just finished my drink for 31 minutes. You want me to go get you another? I want some more wine. I'll grab you another. Uh, do we have this? Is your house, but. Oh, you're not doing the, the live stream, right? So you can cut. Yeah, yeah I can cool. cut whatever the fuck I want. Cool. So you guys don't know Bre- exactly what I said. Bring that bottle out. Hey, Gordon, what's going on with your eye, man? I see you keep rubbing it. I don't know, man. It's fucking bothering me. It's red, dude. You got you got Is pink eye? Take nah, it's just bothering me. We are still recording. <laughs> the side of it, like right here, is red. You got pink it's that eye, crack. Bro. I got a damn pink eye. Crack. Dude, dude, you know they're saying that now, like COVID, the like main symptom of COVID now is pink eye? What? Fuck. Yeah, so I all, just hugged you. I hugged COVID. you, and now my eyes fucked up. Ma- you have, just had COVID, bro. I have no, I didn't. I have IBS. That's what I have. I think. You don't got no damn IBS. You got AIDS, man. <laughs> You got fucking AIDS. <clears throat> yeah, so I, I apparently didn't have COVID, um, and I'm just getting old, and my bowel movements can't handle it. You know. So you like I got I, I'm kind I got IBS. Um, no, thank you, sir. I just like so Appreciate the symptoms you. I've been having, dude, Jeez. is like horrible, uh, horrible like stomach cramps and gas. Some water? Uh, sure, hook me up, dude. You want Pepto uh, no, I'm good right now. I took some gas X, bro. I, I took some gas X. He needs something for his leaky booty. Leaky booty. Yeah. We got some uh, triple max tampons in here, you know, if you want some. They're might, denim, though. I might need one. They're denim. <laughs> denim. <laughs> you know, how bad that would hurt. Denim tampon. Denim tampons. Jesus Christ. That, that's what the fucking, like, Amish use, bro. Holy I made a tampon with spikes on it. No, nah, the Amish <laughs> use wood. It'll never fall out. The Amish use wood. You just wood, <laughs> wood tampons. Get splinters in your butt. <laughs> Can't wait to go to Georgia, bro. This is gonna be so know, much dude. fun. Uh, yeah, so Cannot we're going wait. to. Uh, when is this coming out? Oh, jeez, I don't know. Fucking remember. All right, never mind. <laughs> uh, 2047. If you're, if you were in Georgia, if and you, you missed, are in Georgia, when we going next week? So August 11th through the 13th, we'll be in Georgia. What part Cummings, we're going to Cumming, right? Cumming. Is that where I mean, JB that's lives? where we're gonna sleep. Cumming, we're gonna sleep oh, in Cumming. Fayette, Fayette, Fayetteville, sleep Fayetteville, in Fayetteville, and somewhere else. Milton, Mil- Milton, yeah. The same. It's. I think it's like a Vietnamese franchise. Oh, oh, we're gonna be in a restaurant. I Is think it, so. How many shows you guys doing? Like one or just two? Um, two. Two. two shows. And then we're gonna hold Rootstock hostage. Yeah. And so we're gonna, <laughs> just gonna go up. We're just gonna show <laughs> up there. You guys, Jay. Jay's coming. Uh, jo- the JoJo's, both, both the JoJo's. Yeah, I don't think you ever met JoJo Casillas and JoJo I White. I don't think I have. Yeah, nah, yeah, because they were gone. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> they were gone before you nah, you started popping up. They're the homies. I like when did I see you? It's the Snappers open mic, right? You sna- yeah, I was like maybe like two or three months into doing it, and I, I saw yeah, you. Snappers open, open mic. Yeah, you made me. You made me laugh. Oh, I, I, I forget you. what the fuck you said, but I was like, ah! you know, I do well, that. I mean, ah! You made well. I when I saw you, I was like starstruck. I was like, this guy is so fucking good. You want to blow me? Yes. Huh. Don't blow him up more than what he already has. Hey, when I saw you this too, man, I was good, fucking. Bro. I was like Dude, starstruck I too. <laughs> Whatever. <laughs> Because I when suck. he told me how long you've been doing comedy for, I told you this in the live last last He's time. He's been we doing did it fifty stream, years. I was just like, should I be talking to this guy? Because like I tried like you know getting cool with like some of the other people, uh, and they're like, oh hey, you're young, you're fucking. Like, I'm just like, mm. well, that's I mean, they, all they, they were with me, man. That's yeah, how, and I was just like, okay, well, I mean, I'll I'll figure it out. That's how G Grind was formed, because I, I used to post uh, grinding after all my open mic pictures I would put, people get and so, all the old so haters on Tampa Bay comedy page. You, you not doing anything. You not grinding. Uh, fuck you, man. Like, how else are you supposed to start? Exactly. I mean, like, you should be excited about doing this shit. You know how hard it is to do comedy. You know how hard it is to stay excited. Yeah. Fuck. Doing comedy after after eight bombs in a row. You know how hard it is to be like, I'm gonna go bomb again. You know, you know how hard it is to wear denim underwear, guys. Yeah. You know how hard it is to fuck in denim underwear. (laughs) You know how hard I am right now. Exactly. Show us right now. Show us your (laughs) dick. 
much I wish that mustache dick. Yeah. There's a lot. There's so many haters in freaking Tampa. It's, they're, they're, it's, it's I sad, think it's in man. Every they're comedy really, community, though. Yeah. I, I, I don't, yeah, you're right. I don't know every comedy. But here. But yeah, I've noticed. And it's the same here, four people. It's just the same four people. It's all. Yeah, I've noticed here, yeah, there's a lot more people that like to talk down, especially the ones that are like, oh, I've been doing this for 15 years. What the, what the fuck are you doing now? Nothing. The same yeah. exact shit they I were mean, doing 15 years ago. Exactly. I'm cool with it. If you're cool with me, I'm cool with you. Yeah, that's, 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 yeah exactly there's only like a couple is. people that I don't fuck with, but uh, mm-hmm. I'm not going to be like online talking shit about them either. I'm going to say it to your face. I'm just going to say it on the podcast right now. I'm just cool. kidding. You have to say it. I don't, <laughs> I, I don't. I, dude, I've been. <laughs> I said it. I don't I give a shit. It. I don't give a <laughs> shit. <laughs> Fuck him. Cut it. Cut it. Cut it. We'll talk about it. Uh, I know. You're doing uh, a show with him or something, right? Yeah, it's the second time I'm doing it. It was Just uh, keep the, that the, dude at a distance, bro. The first time. I do was, shady as shit. I'm going to say, I, you can cut it out or leave it. I don't give a fuck. F- first show is kind of a nightmare, but uh, hopefully the second one will be okay. I mean, we're all right. I mean, like, I'm not like, you can't talk. I'm just going to say, if, I will say. Uh, if you see a producer with more money than what you get after the show, which is everybody, most of the people that do shows, put yeah, shows no. together here, mm-hmm. keep it all and give you pennies. But I mean, I wouldn't do that, but I mean, I get it. Especially if you're only doing that, you're not really working and stuff. Like mm-hmm. some people don't, they just put the shows on and shit. And well, then, when but. you're a young comic, you're so desperate. And I think some people like take advantage of that. Oh, then they definitely do. Well, I just I, said his name. He takes that, advantage of you. <laughs> he does, bro. I'm telling you, man. I, I tell everybody that works with him, just be careful. I'm not saying Gordon's don't work with him. making me work here, folks. I got to do a lot of editing. I'm just after saying, this just stay a distance, bro. I won't say no more. Just it's clip, it's clip great. I, I, for I, Gordon. Gordon <laughs> here you go. I'll post it. He knows I don't like him. <laughs> that's, that's fucking crazy. I don't know. I mean, like, I'm not, I'm, I'm not the get. Yeah, but I am do the shows. You know what I'm saying? But no. I wouldn't, like, keep them close. You know, there's some people you got to keep at a distance. I mean, I, like will, I, I mean, I yeah. will, I will say this: if I, if I had a, you know, choose someone <laughs> I could trust, <laughs> definitely I'll. Tr- I, yeah, yeah, I choose you. I appreciate per, per, it, bro. Per, per, I don't put shows personally. on though for that purpose because yeah. I don't, I don't want that added stress. Mm-hmm. I tried to. I was, <clears throat> I was trying to do a show, like start a showcase at this fucking yeah, I remember you. brewery, and as oh, soon yeah, you told me about that, as yeah. soon as I gave them a budget because I'm not giving you a free <clears throat> show, yeah, free entertainment. And that's they, what they want. They like were like, yeah, we can't. Well, do it they anymore. assume that a lot, of, a, a lot of places like that assume that they're you're gonna make money for them, which is true. But it's also like, I'm grinding too, man. I gotta make my own. I gotta well, yeah, I would have brought you know? them a whole new audience. Yeah. Like, I know a lot of people that want to come to shows. Have you guys been to Title yet in uh, Spring Hill? Title a, Title mm-hmm. Brewing. Uh-uh. It's it's a new mic. It's been going on for a couple months now in in Spring Hill. It's far as shit from you and I, especially. It's close to me. Close Spring to Hill's you. Not far from it's every. every is Spring other Hill Wednesday. north or is it yeah. south? It's north. It's north. Yeah, it's a good fucking room, man. Like I'll, I'll tell you, I'll tell you what, man. Like every, they, all others, mm-hmm. they always get a bunch of people in on Wednesdays. The guy who runs it is not a comedian, but he's a huge fan of comedy. So he'll like host and basically not. He'll just be like, all right, well, here comes the show. Bring out the first comic and stuff. See, yeah. I hate that. You have to set it yeah. up with your host. You can't well, just be like your the, first comic's the, name. Is he the like ro- learning how to do comedy? See, and like I, you he's know, got a room? you know, that's maybe cool because that's like his he'll like watch us and like study us and like laugh his ass off when, whenever we get on. But he never he has, he has never done like jokes or anything before either. Like from the times I've been there, so. that ain't a host, man. That you're just a, you're just an announcer. Basically, yeah, pretty much. Yeah. But hey, if he's got, if he's running a, a room for stage time, or just get hosts, it's a host. Yeah. Well, I actually talked with the owners, and the owners are like are super thrilled about what's been going on with uh, with there. And I told him, I said, "You guys can do, you guys can make a lot of money with showcases if you guys want to do like once a month, like have like you know pay like like pay some yeah. comics to come and do like fifteen minutes each." And yeah. and, she, and they're like, "Oh, we love that idea." So I I, I ran that by the host. And I told him, Don't I said, run it by the host. Well, yeah, I told him, put it well, I told him, I said, look. You know, we can like host the, the the shows if you you know you don't feel comfortable hosting these kind of showcases. And he he, he said, yeah, definitely. But the thing is, it, there's no stage; it's just literally a floor. You know, you just get up there, kind of like soggy bottom a we little bit. We built one. Yeah, just build. Yeah, just build Dude, a stage. You literally, yeah, pallets. you could get some. Cra- I can yeah. get I can get pallets for you at my yeah. job. I find them. I see them all the time. I yeah, yeah, grab them for pallets. You. you fucking nail like two or four together, and then. Put a little carpet on it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That, that's what Stefano did for a long time when he was like grinding with um, uh, finding spots to host and that's stuff. That's what Coastal Creative did when they first started. Yeah, I literally did the first competition. It was on pallets. 
That's funny. It was literally on pallet. I mean, it was they made it look cool with the lighting and shit. Can't That'd get be... in that room no more. Yeah. Same people being that. That's that's uh, whatever. I've only done that room. Right, I ain't gonna done... talk. I don't have to make you edit more shit. <laughs> I've only done it once. How about community. how about you, you can gonna say move. you know what? Let me tell you what you, they did. How about this? You can say the names, but say like instead of like no, nah, I'm not gonna who, say no names. Say like Bertha or Leslie. or No, something I'm not or. gonna say no. I won the one of the competitions, right? And then they did a show where they brought all the winners back. Didn't even put me on it. That's fucky. Did you tell them? Yes, I was there that night because Jay was on it. And I went to the support, and I walked up to you know who it is, and I was just like, bro, I won this too. Oh, you did. Yeah, I know exactly. I know. We know you're talking about. So, it's so okay. not only, nah, I get no love no more, man. I'll have Am I an asshole? Do you? Well, I'm out. I, I'm not think, an asshole, right? I think you're the sweetest guy I've ever met. I feel like people are, are, like think I'm like I'm. I'm you, you, I think you, I'm holier than now because I feature now I or will something. Say you suck. You <laughs> royally. <laughs> you. That's all I want to hear. That's all I want to hear. You serenade me with your R and B ness, and I I love going. I'm R and B. You are you are the R and B of comedy. It's because you're just sexy and, and slow motion, man. <laughs> exactly, man. That's what I'm talking about. That's what I. Even though my it's eyes it's red as shit right now. Board bit. That's what it is. Bro, I haven't done that bit in a while. I bet. I've been doing so much get, new shit, man. To I told. I, you're down there. I told. Right, you're right. Sloan, the gout takes over. <laughs> I told Sloan. I said, "Yo, next time you get a show going, make some charcuterie boards because he makes some good charcuterie boards." He does. His job and he he, 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 he gave like, me he told me to lay down and with that bit. He was like, if you're going to act it out, like, get on the ground or lay on the stool. And I was going to lay on the stool, but I don't have good balance anymore. So I was like, I'm falling every time, which would probably be funny. Shout out to Sloan, Sloan. everybody. Oh, he just gave me a bunch of feature dates with him on a boat Fuck cruise yeah, Dude, yeah, yeah. He's a from last Sloan. night. Yeah. Hell yeah, I love Sloan. He gave me some dates last year. But he's always been cool. Since, like, first time I saw him, I was at the improv, the open mic. Mm-hmm. He's always been cool, man. That's a good dude. It's hard to find them old school dudes that are like that. That are humble yeah. and fucking. That are like just cool. Like Tony God's always been cool with me. Yeah, he's the first one that like literally like put me on. Yeah. He like gave me chances in, in Tampa. Cause he's just you know what I mean? If if you if you're funny, they like that's all I, that's yeah. what you should. If you're funny, we like you. If you're not funny, you'll get there. You that's, know? that's like me with Johnny. Jo- Johnny's always been really good. Johnny to me, Bell. So Johnny B, yeah. Yeah, Johnny, yeah, he's cool. He's cool. I was supposed to do his room in <coughs> Sefner at some point, but then he never told me. He has me. a room? I think it's like he has in a room? Sefner. Johnny's a room? I don't know. Oh, yeah. You know what? He was telling me about that. He's yeah, starting it back up or something. Oh, I don't, yeah. oh, shit. That's fucking awesome. <clears throat> I don't know. I wanna, I wanna, I'm going to do one. I want to put one show together, my own show, before I move. Just to have like a... Snappers? Headline the shit. Maybe. Out, like Sna- or Sunshine. I love, sun- I love, yeah, so I love Sunshine. Room. Kenny's that always... so cool. So I'm gonna talk to him. I want to me, me and Jay want to try to do unscripted there. Bring that back. Oh yeah. Okay. But then you didn't. Leaving? You never but done that, leaving? right? No. Huh? But you leaving? Yeah, but it can still. I can still come back from shows and shit. I'm not gonna leave Florida and be like, I'm never coming back. Like my girlfriend's still gonna be, be here. Be gone for me. Yeah. What? Huh? I am oh. never coming back. <laughs> oh, I thought you were high five. Oh no, I was. Uh, I was. Uh, <laughs> Let's make it awkward. Uh, well, you can. You can high five. You keep putting your hand there. I got a high five. <laughs> oh, that's it. That's just. Natural reaction. I'm a high fiver. See, hands. look, hey, 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 you got a ring. Look at that. He's, he's married, he's bro. Not fucking kidding. My precious. That looks like a very tight ring. It's actually not. So, so how was the honeymoon, man? Didn't good. ask you. It was good. We didn't have. Did you have as, a lot of sex? We did not have as much sex as you're supposed to oh, on the honeymoon. The fuck? Because I stuck on you, bro. We, she was on a period. Whatever. No. Whatever we were. You were eating, on your period. What? It, probably. Yeah. Whatever we were eating <laughs> gave us like. <laughs> So much gas. So like we were gassy this? the whole week and like farting so much. Fart on each like, other. Who gives a shit? It's dude, your honeymoon. Dude, this is you you're know? married now. You can do whatever the fuck you want. You can fart on each other. You can pee on each you other. You know how a, a cigarette smoker's like house is like full, Always like, smell like full cigarettes. of cigarette. Like the yeah. nicotine is in the walls. That's what our <clears throat> hotel room was. It was fart. Yeah. Farts were in you're, the what, walls. Were we in the keys? We would fart. And then leave and then come back and the fart smell still in there. That's a lingering fart. That's a good fart. I would still fart. I was eating fish tacos a lot. Fish tacos are fucking good. Like mahi mahi, black and mahi mahi. Where'd you where we where'd you go? We were in Key Largo. Oh, that's really right, cool. that's right. Key Largo. I fished like every Key every Largo. morning while she like slept in. Yeah. Fucking caught some barracuda. That was really. Oh cool. yeah, barracudas are fucking strong. Yeah. Yeah, dude. Big? How big were they? I caught the one I caught was like the size of my arm. So yeah, was, you got a decent. big old one. Fuck yeah. barracuda! They killed Nemo's mom. They did. They did. Has barracuda. They Finding did. Nemo. I don't remember that. You have seen Finding Nemo? Yes, I don't remember. Yeah, that Yeah, the beginning where the barracuda is just going like this. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. And then yeah, 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 yeah. Marlin's like, fish. Coral, just get in the Coral. enemy. <laughs> Coral. They're weird fish, dude. They just—they literally just float. 
Did you, wait? Did you um? Did you spear? Did you spearfish? No, with the pole. And I literally, I didn't have what any. Pl- the is the pole your dick? dick? Yeah. <laughs> if it were big enough. This is bobbing in the water. <laughs> bing, bing. <laughs> my bait. Dude, Fish is like, give, that give that it. You, you, down in the keys, there's like a little tarpon uh, thing where you can like literally just like go and hand feed tarpon. You can literally just hover your dick right over the water and they'll just bite it off. I don't want to do that. You know? Yeah, I'm, yeah, I'm cool. I, just, I like my I dick. Like you guys fucking. I don't have an amazing out. dick, but I like it. I mean, it works. <laughs> <laughs> Still, yeah. Does it look like? Does it look like my microphone? I. The lighter. Nah, it's a little lighter than that. <laughs> now, now, this is a question that everybody wants to know. <laughs> like, is how, it black? How how black are your genetics in your <clears throat> penis? Did you get? So my dick is this dark, about as dark as Jay Legend. It's weird. It doesn't see the sun. The weirdest thing. Why is that the dark part? It should be the white. It's supposed to be white. It should be white. It never sees sun. I don't. I'm not out there sunbathing. That's true. It'd probably get darker if I did. It'd be like this shit. Be dark as fuck. All all of your melanin just went straight to your penis, which makes it bigger. It does look bigger, especially when I shave it. It's just like it's just looking at you like, "What's up, yo?" (laughs) Got a new haircut. I got a new haircut. (laughs) Ever flex like in in like certain lighting? You look swoller, dude. Yeah. 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 You do the dick ups. Jay, Jay used to do I don't know cock, if he still does push, a joke. Cock push ups. Big ups. Yeah. You ever seen Tenacious D? Oh, uh, with uh, Jack Black. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, I've seen parts of it. Give me one cock push up. One cock push up. Bro, I don't know what the fuck is going on in my eye. It's, you got, since you got here, you got I, I got have uh, eye drops. You want eye drops? Yeah. Yeah. Hold on. Give him some eye drops. It's really acid. Let's really. edit this. We're gonna get we're gonna get Gordon high on acid. We're gonna get. Bro, the, the, you want me to be high. How was your guest by last night? I fucking Bomb? bombed. <laughs> I got last, but it was like so... They were so tight. They were just... I don't know. I, they felt, I felt like they just was like, I don't want to... They didn't laugh really at anyone until Sloan got up. Mary-Kate got broke them in a little bit, but... Yeah. I haven't been I haven't been to Snappers in a while. My fucking Lakeland show, I fucking murdered that shit. Uh, Where was that? Fine, uh, that was at LOL. Oh, on Thursday. Yeah, that yeah, shit yeah. was that, and there was like fifty people there. It was you got, nice. You, you filmed your set. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I recorded it. That's what's up. I've never. No, nah, I got it. it. You want to get real gay with this? Huh? <laughs> <laughs> Not that kind of. Drop. Open your mouth, Gordon. <laughs> I've never been to LOL. I've always, I always want to, but I don't yeah, get I off. Been, I, I don't get off either, working no. time on Wednesdays to fucking <clears throat> drive out there. LJ said he'll give me some spots uh, on on a weekend because he's doing more showcases there. Yeah, that's the only thing that sucks. It's so far away. Thanks, bro. So far away. I finally I I have hosting Sponsored dates by again Opcom. at Snappers October. Whenever you hear this, October, I think eleventh. I'm, the I'm gonna post an October. Oh yeah, those are the ones I turned down. So you're the nice way. He's like, you want these dates? I was like, nah, give it to Devin. <laughs> Fuck, <laughs> I was man. playing, bro. I knew I knew as soon as like I told George I was in the hospital. And he fucking gave my dates away that it was going to be a, a fucking hell of a time trying to rebook it. Because everything he's given me, he gave me, um, I'm so mad. I didn't realize it was for Rio. He gave me Rio the, to host for Rio's dates. Oh, yeah, because like, Rio's, yeah, and, and then Bull. The That's going to be a good show. I fucking know, man. Who's and hosting that? I didn't realize. I don't know. I didn't ask who. Somebody who, trash, who, probably. Who got it. You hosting but, it? <laughs> <laughs> How did you catch <laughs> <laughs> that was fucked you're, up. You're, you're, you're guest spot and I'm just kidding. Yeah, I'm gonna go. I want to go see Rio, so yeah, I'm probably gonna, gonna go, go Saturday night shows. or something. Go. When when are these shows? August Next 24th. two weeks. Two weeks. Twenty mm. fourth. Yeah. Twenty third. JJ's got it. JJ and Jay are doing a show tomorrow at Snappers, right? What? When's yeah. he leaving? Isn't JJ he's leaving? leaving? Next like, week, I think. Oh yeah, soon. Where, where, he's, yeah, going, oh, his, he's, he's going to New York or Dubai. Austin. He's doing Dubai on the twelfth, and we're not gonna be here. Bummed about that. I think they're doing a dinner, he said, I think on the 8th or something. We're I'm going somewhere. Invited. I'm not invited. To the, I'm not just going to show up to the dinner. <laughs> Probably not, but I was just going to tell you anyways. Let's get them drunk and be like, Devin, hey, what's up, man? <laughs> you just come. Who gives a fuck? What's he going to say? No, you can't come. I'm Gordon's date. Well, plus I, one. You'll be my I plus have, one. I have Gordon's penis right in front of me, so I think I'm his date. Actually. That's definitely not mine, but that's my older brother's. So that's what the that thing was. Like. It's a furry, that dude had a, that dude a has furry a hall. wiener. Uh, nah, I shave. A furry wiener? On the I tip. mean, it does look like there's a fro on that shit. Yeah. I got a goatee on my t- <laughs> <laughs> You got a dick tee? It's my goatee. It's all red it's stuff. All my- <laughs> oh, God. Are you guys um, into hair? 
Is that a thing you're into? Like, like does hair down, bother you on a woman? On a chick, yeah. Like, like in, I don't like, like hair. Vagina. Like, like pussy hair? Yeah. I don't mind stubble, but I don't want it no. furry. No, you're not. Or like a, if she does like a little landing strip, I don't mind that. But I don't know. want like. No, I like I, I prefer uh, some hair because it's like yeah, I'm not looking at a kid's pussy. You know. It's the like, first chick I ever had more. sex with had a bush. Well, well, that was, was she, in what, what was 1985. Yeah. So well, she but well, she was 80. So it was like <laughs> was, it was, was she a Jehovah's Witness? push. Yeah. Oh nice. yeah. She, she remember, was old I've, I've old lady. This story. Wait, was she really an old lady? Or was she like? Uh... Yeah, she was like. She's no, she was 80, but she was like 75 or something. You fucked a 75 year old. Yeah. How old were you? Yeah, it was 15. No shit. Yeah, yeah that's bro. Fucking really hilarious. I was mowing her lawn, and I I you never literally wore mowed her lawn was, after that. <laughs> yeah. Then I mowed her lawn. Yeah. Was it all gray and like look like Gandalf or something? I, I don't. It wasn't. I don't think it was that amazing because I don't really remember. I just remember having sex. I don't remember every little detail, but not bad. It was like ew, she was old. Oh she's god, like, it was god. great. She, so great. Dude, I love if you think about it, she's, she's, she'd be like a hundred if she was alive now. She'd be at least she'd be seven hundred years old. It's <laughs> Yoda. She was one of those that looked like she was gonna die at any minute, and I was like, so I, I got to so, get this in so before you die. So what were you, you thinking? Were you, were you just like I was horny? I was fifteen, bro. Yeah, 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 and as Jehovah's Witness, you're not supposed to have sex at all. You can't even masturbate. That's a sin. So we're just horny. Oh, hell no. Everyone's horny. I wouldn't have been. I would have been coming. I went to a party and I walked into a room one time and everyone was dry humping. That's how horny they were. Like, get the fuck. Burnt out of denim here. is a real smell. Burnt denim. That's awesome. And it was no lights on and you just hear people rubbing <laughs> pants together. That's how. <laughs> that was the freakiest thing you could do. Dry hump. Remember dry humping oh, days? Yeah. Oh yeah. That shit hurt so bad. I was like, why am I doing this, man? I don't, th- I don't think I ever really did. I think like I was such a fucked up kid that like we were just like like just pull it out. Like I was getting getting head at like twelve. No shit. Yeah, like seventh grade I've got You were giving head at twelve? No, Damn, getting, bro. That getting. priest really got you. He was speaking in tongues. <laughs> <laughs> So I to do that. No. Yeah, I was young, but yeah, because we were told. And then my older, my brothers were all older, so they were all like fucking, and they had porn everywhere. My dad had porn, so I was just a horny ass kid. My mom was like, "Read the Bible if you get excited." I was like, "Bitch, I can't read." <laughs> Where's that Adam and Eve story? I wrote this. I remember. Can I just be with Eve the entire time? I wrote a joke about that, like, because there's a scripture about Jesus riding an ass. I'm like, yeah, yeah. what kind of ass? It's probably a Latin <laughs> ass, yeah. I mean, he, did, he was friends with the prostitute. Yeah, there oh, yeah. I mean, yeah. Like, you, sh- you shouldn't fucking shit there, feel bad. <laughs> there's another scripture in there about, like, this guy's talking about his sister's little little tits or something like that, They're, like little peaks of mountains or something. It was, it was a good time. Hell, yeah. It was a great time right there. And then he fucked his sister. And then he fucked his sister. Yep, I read that scripture. I mean, jerked dude, off it's, twice. It's all about incest in the fucking Got come Bible. on dude, the Bible. Dude, <laughs> there's, Oops. There's more incest going on in the Bible than there is in West Virginia, everybody. And we all fucking know that. Well, back then, you know, that, that's... There was only like 10 people, dude. Yeah, yeah. exactly. <laughs> yeah, they were like saving humanity. Adam and, Adam and Eve's kids fucked each other. They're like, oh, look at our kids, honey, and they're all just banging the shit so out of So we're all there. related in some way or another. Hell if yeah. If you go all the way back, all the way back, mm-hmm. to full access passes to Bush fucking Gardens, yeah! baby. That's a callback, baby. Yeah. Come on. Bush Gardens, Bush baby. Bush fucking Gardens. Where everyone doesn't shave, like the first girl. Check out our sponsors, Bush Gordon Gardens. That's banged. right. Yeah. She had a bush with roller coasters and safaris <laughs> and shit. It looked like a lion's mane. That's that's not that's a joke. I didn't. My first time I had sex was with two black girls. I don't know what to believe anymore now. Yeah, but I did have sex with an older woman, like fifteen. But it wasn't Se- the first time I had sex. Seventy-five. I was like eleven when I had sex, huh? Were you, you really? were eleven yeah. when you had sex. Were you yeah. raped? Oh no, no, I tore them black girls up. What you talk about, bro? I'm a man. First time I had sex was a threesome. I was a senior. It's the high worst school. threesome I've ever been in. I was in college. Yeah, because they didn't even really care about you. Mm-hmm. No, they didn't at all. They didn't even know I was there. Mm-hmm. They were like, are you in yet? I was like, I've been done seven hours ago. Like, you guys got to go. <laughs> you got to go. <laughs> I'm going to cry now. <laughs> I've been done. I'm reading the Bible right now. <laughs> I'm praying to... C- I didn't have a condom, so my boy uh, told me to cut the edge wait, of... Sh- wait, did you even come? I mean, like... No, I didn't. I so saying, it wasn't really... Yeah, it was... But they were terrible looking. It was bad. It smelled... They smell. It was bad. But I didn't have a condom, so he told me to cut the edge of... The edge of uh, the ends... Of a, a Ziploc bag, sandwich bag, and use that. So I did. I cut the ends and I put a rubber band. <laughs> Came off right away. <laughs> it was great, bro. 
Dude, this was Gail uh, this, Connum of her fucking. This is 1988. Come on, bro. What's it was 11. What's crazy is that they were just like cool with that. Like they saw you walk out and they, you have a Ziploc bag. Did it like, get like, off? Oh, they were into hey, each Gord, other. Did you make some sandwiches? No, it's my condom. <laughs> bro, they were into each other. I would, I, my boys would pay me money so they can come to my house because my parents didn't get home until like five or six. So after school, they would give me like 10 bucks and just bang chicks. Huh. So my boy Spud so was ran, like, "Hey, you want to go?" So you ran a Jehovah's Witness sex house. I run a, I run a, I ran a brothel. You, bro. you literally ran a brothel. There's nothing more Christian than that. One yeah. of the girls was reading a wash tower after naked in the kitchen. I was like, "You gotta go. Like you can't stick around." <laughs> God's watching you, bitch. Then the last time I did it, my mom came home and I had to hide everybody in the closet and wait till she went to shower. And then let tell you gotta go go go. go. It, was, <laughs> it was great, bro. Lead it was the not greatest to time. I gotta tell that story on stage. That shit is funny. Dude, I used to charge him. That's, that's hilarious. Dude, I used to charge him, bro. Dude, you, dude, you literally, you're fu- you were a pimp back then. Dude. I was. I had a brothel. That's fucking. I never even thought about that. That's you a brothel. You literally ran a brothel. They would be like, "Hey, Gordon, what time's your mom coming?" I'm like, five five thirty. <laughs> Can we come? Yeah, yeah, man, bring him. <laughs> oh, we're coming. They literally was. Yeah, they were coming. There's one girl had huge tits. I was like, but she, I don't, I don't she, she didn't smell good. That's crazy, bad. man. It's good times. And I don't know why my mom didn't smell. The house smelled like sex. I bet. Because you said they stink. Yeah. And it was five of them. And you heard how old? You said 15? I was in middle school. So I was, yeah, I was probably, no, I wasn't. I was probably like 11 or 12. You want to hear the crazy things that I was doing in middle school? So this one time, my dad gave me his uh, virus infested gateway computer, big ass desktop, right? And it had like, like what, it, it child was, porn or it something? was, dude. <laughs> no. Let's uh, hope not. Let's hope not. Not Jesus yet. Christ. With that not mustache, yet. probably. <laughs> <laughs> so uh, let's get my Dahmer glasses. So can be there. My dad gave gave us this gateway computer and it had all these pop ups, right? And me, my brother, my best friend, boy, like I told my best friend about it, and we were all like, my no one was home, so we started watching porn on this computer. Right, and then we all ah, just classic. chose a corner in the bedroom and jerked off together Aww. in the bedroom, just oh, different corners. So we were, you, were your backs to each other, or yeah. you were facing? No, we we're back, like because that's limp biscuit, corner. right? Into the corner. Limp that's biscuit. what limp biscuit is, right? Yeah. Well, are you talking about wait, limp biscuit? No, we're, yeah. The we're, meaning of limp biscuit is nah. you jerk off in a circle or on like a biscuit or something. Oh, they, oh yeah, I've heard. There of were no that. biscuits involved. There's no, no biscuits. Yeah. Uh, it was just we were just coming in different corners. <laughs> that's hilarious. <laughs> no, it's it, no. That reminds me of the bit. I, that reminds me of the bit I'm writing about how white boys were actually straight white boys back then were super gay. Like how we watched porn together. We we played smear the queer. I and never stuff, watched yeah. porn with my friends. I did. Never. Yeah. I mean, we would look at magazines, but it wasn't Sin. like we were jerking off Sin. looking at the magazines. Oh, no. I never jerked off with my friends or anything like that. that I had Yo, I, mean, I had out. ones that would try to do it, and I would say, go to the fucking bathroom, you fucking queer. Go. And <laughs> fucking queer. Dude, this dude's getting real racist over here. It's racist. What's homophobic. Queer homophobic. I'm not homophobic. I, I don't know. I, I was I fucking got, I got, I got We're homophobic. taking you back to Target. You fucking okay? queer. <laughs> we're taking you back to Target. You You're going to drink Bud Light. You're going to drink some Bud Light. I have LGBTQ family members. That doesn't mean you gotta like them. I love them. <laughs> Fucking hate them goddamn people. <laughs> Go back to your country, white power. <laughs> <laughs> I love Dave Chappelle. I gotta go soon, dude. Look at that! You guys know I'm on a tight How long schedule. Doing? I don't know. You doing a show tonight? No, I uh, people coming over to the house. We're gonna watch the fights. Oh yeah. Oh, we I'm got gonna, time. I'm gonna pirate them fights. Hell yeah. Come out later. So I don't come. want Nate Diaz to lose though. He's going I'm to. so tired of him knocking out MMA dudes. He's, he's, you fight a boxer, he loses. Now he's like, I'm going back to MMA, guys. I hmm. guarantee you, uh, I I think I I think Nate can go the distance, or they'll stop it because he has so much fucking scar tissue on his face that he's going to open cut up. Open, yeah, and he won't be able to see. He's always bleeding, so he's know, definitely going to be cut uh, up. Yep. I think I mean Jake is just all like people hate on him, but like he can you box. Watch him, he's yeah, smart. You watch him Jake, box. Jake, Jake Paul's smart as shit. I just don't want I, Nate I like Diaz the to guy, lose. But I think Jake Paul's a smart fucking dude. At the end of the day, it's all a show. Yeah, yeah. Like you watch like all the shit talk. Like they're literally gonna after the fight hug and then make ten million. Go hang out, yeah, and and, and go fuck a bunch go hang of out. bunch of chicks after. They're gonna go smoke weed together. Have you seen uh, Jake Paul's girl? Hmm. She's, she's like a Olympic like ice skater or whatever like not like a dancer but the speed skate whatever they do not a shocker yeah. freaking hot edit that out so my girlfriend will see <laughs> edit that out now Gordon's Go, fucking do it now patina you're awesome yeah <laughs> i love my wife i love my wife and i love my wife. i need you to clip that so i can show her need you to clip that one <laughs> 
Um, yes. I so. love comedy. Uh, I love comedy. I love, I love comedy. How long you been doing it now, Scott? It'll be two years. Two years. How do you feel? Feeling pretty good. I mean, you got two hundred and fifty thousand subscribers on your YouTube. Not because of my comedy. Do you I don't mean, you don't post they, clips or anything? I any post, jokes? I post clips. Yeah. yeah, they love you though. Yeah, they. You got a good squad. Give them a little taste. Yeah, they. Where's your do. little trophy? You don't have that up. It's over. It's, it's in my office. Oh, okay. Yeah. My office over there. It's in my <laughs> office. <laughs> if you go through owner. the kitchen, you'll see the office right there. This guy's a business owner, a person owner. You're mad at it, man. Your office is a fucking trash. I don't truck. have a fucking <laughs> office. You're right. I don't have an office at all. It's a bathroom. That's where I do all my meditating. You and masturbating. Find, you Meditating, find me masturbating. At the Jewish Community Center. At the Jewish Community the Center. Jews. How's that going for you? Um, I would rather be broke and doing comedy on the road than have that job. Sounds about fucking I'm right. I'm I'm in the same boat right now. I want to fucking I want to quit my job so bad. Yeah, I keep warning. Just, I keep telling Caitlin. I'm like, dude, I'm ready? holding on to I'm December. Ready to quit. I'm. I'm ready. You better tell somebody in your family we need a place to live because I am ready to quit. Oh, yeah, <laughs> I'm holding on till December. But yesterday I wanted to quit so bad. I, I, used, I had to use a that. truck with no AC. It Ugh, was so fucking fuck, hot. Fuck that. And it, and it, and there's little fans in there, but it's just blowing hot it's air. Blowing hot on fucking air. It. So it's, it's making like, you it's sweat blowing, more. It's like blowing farts on you that don't stink. Yeah. And then I go to turn the truck in, and then the mechanic guy's like, well, "I'm not fixing it till Tuesday." I was like, "I don't give a fuck. I'm just not gonna use this shit." I don't have to. I got another truck that I use Monday through Wednesday, but that has AC. There you go. But shit, yeah, you man. You can't drive with no AC, man. Not, Hell, not, not in Florida. Florida. Jesus Christ. Bro, I if I was like 800 years old, I would die. That's so fucking hot. And I'm outside most of the time, too, because I got to grab the cans and bring them to the truck and dump them. But You don't even have any pee at that point at the end of the day. I like no, you're dry. I like yeah. how we're now in the depressing part of the podcast where we're talking about our miserable jobs. Hey, listen, depression is real. That's how I got into depression comedy, Depression is bro. fucking real, Depression man. is yeah. real. Now, it's funny because, I mean, do you guys, I mean, with all due respect, do you guys go see therapists at all or not? Or Hell no, I'm black. No, man, we don't do that shit. We don't do the fucking therapy. My therapist is a stage. Dude, our, our therapy, yeah, exactly. It's our therapy. Stage. Yeah, Laughs. I have, like, family that they're like, why don't you go see a therapist? My, my therapist is right over there on the stage. Yeah. Just go in there and just talk shit. Laughs, laughs help me cure that shit. Exactly. I haven't been, I'm, I have like little things of depression but not like i used to until i started doing comedy i'm good now i don't really get depressed i just get um i just get really self-critical i think oh, yeah, I oh we all too. do bro oh my god yeah and i think i like talk myself down too much that like that like psychs me out sometimes. i basically what i what i do i kind of like just see myself i i see other my friends who are doing really well and then i see myself and i'm like i could be doing better I mean, like, I get I jealous. I'm, I get I'm, jealous. I'm content. I have a wonderful, I have a wonderful fiance. You know, my job's, my job's okay. You know, I got a cool, you know, you know, the like, comedy's fun. I'm doing, I'm doing pretty good. You know, I'm getting there. Got you guys. You know, I got like a cool, tight knit friends and whatnot. But it's also just like, fuck. I feel like I can do so much better than. I, but that that's everybody. Doing, I, I feel like that all the time. Any artist. Oh yeah, yeah, for sure, man. Any any creative mind always thinks You're, that you are like, your biggest. Yeah. yeah. Critic. I want to be on every show too, so I get it's jealous. True. I'm like, how the fuck they get on that and I didn't? But I, <laughs> I get on shows. It's not. Like, I don't know. It's just in your head. You're just no. in your head. We're all just in our head. But exactly. that's what makes you good. Dude, I thought well, for, I, mean, I thought for the longest time Nabil didn't like me, and then I got an email from him, and he, and he says, literally said, "I like him, George. Give Devin a call." <laughs> See, you never know. I thought BT hated me, bro, because he would never really say anything. But that's just him. He pulled me aside. He was like, "I don't hate you, so stop being a bitch." I was like, "Thanks, B. <laughs> he's just stoic. I think he's <laughs> like he's like he's just stoic. But I. I've been around him when he's drunk and he's on fucking loving dude when it's just like uh, I, when I used to work there oh, and I don't want yeah don't put this up, cut edit this out <laughs> he wasn't drunk but he was feeling good but he was cool he was just like he's, he was like yeah what up, everybody? I was like oh that's me okay but no he's a cool dude you gotta pull him aside and just talk to him yeah, I haven't really talked to BT a whole lot after the Keenan Thompson thing when, when I got off stage he did pat me on the back and that's it yeah, I'm so to be that's the telling you, you, you know, good job. You, you, oh, yeah, we, we, you, we did the show together. That's right. I want if I ever see him in person, I'm gonna fuck him up. You should be like, yo, bitch, I'm gonna be your Kel from now just, on. It's gotta know. There's faces everywhere. You gotta know, man. Because like, I don't, I don't know, man. It just seems there's no way he don't know. If it is, that's a freaking awesome scam, and they're going hard with that because they pack them shows out. I know. Didn't uh what the fuck is Jeremiah? Didn't he like kind of shit on the um, oh, yeah. the show? Like when he yeah. He, yeah, he was like saying, "What the fuck, Keenan?" And then like didn't like he pissed BT off or something? I don't know. I wasn't there. 
Yeah. Oh, so. I, oh, I thought you did the second show. No, nah, I didn't. I no, nah, did, he uh, did. He did Fort Myers. Uh, I was in, oh, you, you did. Oh, yeah, yeah. Did, I was oh, you did a long like, time ago though. Yeah, you did that like boy, like last last year, last year yeah. October. I think yeah. I was over there. Yeah, because it was cold. Yeah, three minutes, bro. Three minutes. Three and the guy that was doing it, man, you're fucking funny. I'm gonna hear, give me your info and all that shit. I don't, don't hear shit, shit from you. Hey, hey, nobody, nobody has won in the last nine seasons that they've been doing it. No, yeah, it's a scam. It's such a money grab. Last, oh, yeah. last time, yeah, I think it was. Yeah, nobody it's just fucking the, won. No, they probably pay him win? for his likeness and his name, and then. You know who did win? I won. Would I you won. win? First round. For the Splitters tournament. Kalta. You're next. Yes. No, next. not Kalta. I didn't get invited to that. I'm not going uh, Which one did you win then? Uh, the, the Cigar City one. Oh, that's right. That's right. Oh, yeah, that's right. True. Hell You're yeah. next. I'm not doing Cigar City. I'm doing the Kalta. I thought you were doing the Cigar City nah, one. No, I'm not on that one. Uh, I think I got on the, the competition, but I don't know when I'm doing it. Never. Never. They're going to just. <laughs> Where was it at? It's at Side Splitters. Yeah. Yeah, I'm not on. I'm, I'm on like the culture. There's like 80 comics on it, dude. I have a feeling. How the by fuck the time are I, they gonna figure that out? Like, jeez. I don't know. I, oh yeah, no, I am on that yeah, one. You just you never won. told I, me I, when. I feel like everybody that does comedy in this area is on it. Yeah. Like consistent, it feels like it. consistent. It's like Florida's like, funniest. Basically, well, Tampa for Tampa's funniest. Yeah, fuck that one too, man. You leave that one in. You I leave heard, that I, in. I, I fuck heard. Um, <laughs> I heard that competition. I heard Jay got fucking cheated. We. I did too. The dude. Oh, oh, you were in it too. Yes. Oh, I didn't know you were in it. The yeah. dude before no, the dude the dude before after me bombed bad. And he got picked top three. What the fuck? So Jokums killed it. He was on it. I right after him, I killed it. The dude after me bombed. And he got top three. It was Jokums just uh I guess he's Indian. I don't know what I'm fucking him was. I don't know what he is. Has I think she, he's Indian. Has, has she is Kundurbi? Kundarbi? Something like that, yeah. Something like that, man. And then Luke, Luke did good too. Luke was Luke was the third person that they found, but they didn't. None of them got anywhere. But still, bomb, bro. I think we need to end this podcast before. Yeah, the no. Community. Am yeah, I gonna am, are, I, am I gonna get yeah, you in trouble? Yeah, we're getting uh, a little over. Yeah, because my yeah, my computer's fucking. I got weird. three words for you. Fuck no. <laughs> well, you guys want to plug in? I'm moving to Austin. Media, Bush, Bush Gardens All Access yes. Pass. No, um, plug in shows, plug in. Yeah, we're gonna be in Georgia next weekend. Yeah. yeah. Um, yeah. and then I got the Culta competition August sixteenth at Side Splitters on a Wednesday. Hell yeah! Come out, vote for me. I'm going up against Jay, so oh I'm going to need God. all the votes that I can get. <laughs> Watch me go up either after him or before him. Vote for Jay Legend. <laughs> <laughs> vote for it because I'm going to vote for him anyway. So, <laughs> fuck it. Nah, we're going to have what you got coming up, buddy. Yeah, we're going to be in Georgia. I got, I'm doing James Hollingsworth's brew show on the 9th, August 19th. Coba Brothers yeah, or whatever that Odessa. brewing place. Brew, the Growler Brew. Oh, that's brew another. Brew he got, he's got some nice rooms. So, I'm going to do that in August, September. I don't, I don't fucking remember what I'm supposed to be doing. October, I'm hosting the Snappers. If yeah, you're, I'm just, hosting the Snappers September, August 30th through oh yeah, you September took my shows. 3rd. You took my show. He man. sent, he texted me first, <laughs> I know, bro. He, I know he did. I didn't even, I don't want to host. I want to feature, but he didn't have no feature days. You I'm featuring there in December. That's what's up. There you but, go. There you go. And I'm doing uh, where you at? side splitters tomorrow. I'm Hell doing yeah. uh. Somewhere in Largo on Wednesday that James Esterline put me on. Um, then I'm doing the other one, you know what show, in uh, September. Oh, no, and, say the show. <laughs> you can say the oh, show. It's it's, a, it's like a new faces of comedy thing yeah. that 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 Taurus is putting on. Yeah, uh, oh, yeah, kill that shit, man. Yeah, bro, I'm, you know it. And kind of <laughs> you can leave catch, that in. Leave that in. You can catch me at the open mic tour. You can, yeah. catch, you can catch me at a bunch of open mics. All of open mics. Oh, and I'm also doing a. Uh, I'm also gonna be in Lake Placid in, on September the 30th. Don't fuck with the alligators over there. Nope. Yeah, you're going swimming? Uh, mm-hmm. No, I'm going to be doing some American Legion. Oh, yeah. So I gotta, Veteran shit. I got to be clean, baby. Oh, yeah. Clean time. I'm going to be like, so fuck how about man. this fucking military? I'm just kidding. This shit. Show. Good luck. It's good to fun. try it. It's have good fun. to try yeah, it to do clean. Yeah, whatever whatever, I mean, whatever like, floats your boat. Well, I mean, well, they're only yeah. 15 clean. And I said, well, how about can I do like seven clean, eight my normal shit and they're like oh, well I mean see what you gotta do because I had a buddy of mine did, who did a uh, American Legion he's still he's like way newer than I am and he uh, did all dirty and fucking ruined like, it yes <laughs> and I was just like, so- it's bad when you're dirty and you're not good that's when it yeah if you're gonna be dirty at least be good yeah well I mean, he's getting there he's it's it's like he's like, he's funny as hell but he's getting there you know he's only like, like three months doing it now and but he'll yeah I guess I guess you know He, I guess he doesn't have much clean material, really. That's uh, 
try to write clean and then you know you could always add dirty words in it that's what they always tell me yeah you know? that's what i try to do anyway i just like talking about my Pussy? wife and i having sex penises no remember that you, show you, you, remember that show the how patter show dude we did a show all right well i'll leave soon we did a show in <laughs> lake city and Gordon must have said pussy like a hundred times. To that lady that didn't like it. <laughs> she didn't like the word. So I'm like, oh, I'm going to go hard on this. And I just kept looking at him and be like, pussy. 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 <laughs> I got funny. that. A yeah, pussy. it was funny. Yeah. Anyway, guys, I love you guys. I admire you love guys you too, so bro. fucking much. You Appreciate guys have you. been amazing to me. Thank you, Thank you for having I'm us. So gl- Gordon, I'm fucking, especially you, I'm glad you came on. It's Finally impo- made it. It's impossible to get you on. Finally made it. It's like, it's like literally trying to fucking get Jesus to come in and, and give me some support. Listen, me and Jesus are tight, okay? We got the yeah. same birthday. So. And De- this is Devin's third time now? <laughs> Wait, you're born December 25th? <laughs> no, that's <not> Jesus' <laughs> birthday, bro. I was like, man. wait a minute, your birthday was just a couple no, days ago. No, he day. died at 33. I stopped being Jehovah's Witness at 33, hey. bro. Well, G- Jesus wasn't Jehovah's Witness. He was Jewish. So he stopped being Jewish at 33. Well, well whatever he was, I stopped it too. Okay. Whatever, whatever he was. Shout out to you, Jesus. Shout out to Jesus. <laughs> say, uh, please say shout out to Jesus. Shout out to the K. See, I mean, he uh, can't. Jewish. He can't even say it. No more. Oh no, he's Jewish. Oh, you're Jewish, right? No, man. Like he's uh, genetically, kinda, it's in kinda, my genes. But yeah. like, I don't fucking denim. Wait, wait, so it's in your denim genes. You cir- me circumcised. I mean, that means it's definitely I am your circumcised. Genes. Yeah, it's Everyone should too. be. It's weird if you're not. It he, looks weird. It just it is aesthetically, weird. it's. I'm not circumcised. Fuck. I don't know. I mean, I don't know what Jehovah's Witnesses just fucking do. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. You gotta have a helmet. No, that that part don't matter. We yeah, just don't yeah, take yeah. blood. They don't take blood. That's like, the biggest uh, thing. Well, blood's life. Huh? Blood is life. That, yeah, that's that's anyway. what they view it as sacred. But anyways. Guys. Guys. This is amazing. This we, has been. We'll we we'll do this again for sure. Have fun What's the name this. of this podcast? It's, it's just it's called, it's good, it's called Cheat Time, but I think I might change oh, it. Cheat, time? cheat Time's boring. No, I mean, that's, what, that's who you are, though. That's it thing. is, but I don't know. I think I might. I think maybe couch time. Couch time. Couch time. We're I mean, on couches. I, I would love to do the Chi experience, but it's Joe Rogan ripping off. Chi right experience. There. Yeah, that's, it's that's ripping off yeah. Joe Rogan. Fuck, yeah. fuck Joe Rogan. I'm just kidding. He's cool as fuck. Oh. I don't even know him, but. I got to see him. Oh, you got to see him. Yeah. He's him. so short. He is, but he's fucking done? stocky, bro. Yeah, oh, you're dude, right. He's you're right. Fucking, dude, he's a hairless chimp. He was ripping through his hoodie. It's fucking weird, but. All right, well. Follow me on Instagram, V Gordon Dixon. Me too. Dev.